boys and girls, it's Miss Melissa for our Let's Find Out Scholastic article all about busy, buzzy bees. Look at that bee. Bees are yellow and black. So our question for our article with our article is, what keeps bees so busy? What do you think? What keeps bees so busy? Let's read and find out. So our next page says bees are busy. Bees are busy eating. So bees eat just like us. They get food from flowers. So bees are busy flying. They fly back and forth to their home, which is their hive. Bees are busy working. We know that one. Work time. Bees are busy working. Bees are busy buzzing. Sing. The sound is their wings moving really, really fast. So that buzz sound you hear are their wings moving really, really fast. Really fast. So this says, don't bug the busy bees, bear. Most bees won't sting if you don't bother them. So that's all the things that bees do to stay busy. Those are busy, busy bees. So for our last page, it says an insect is an animal with three body parts and six, let's see if I can make the number six, six legs. Some insects have wings. A bee is an insect. So we're gonna count the legs on each critter below. So let's see, how many legs does the snail have? Hmm, let's see, here's our snail. Do you see any legs? I don't. What about our spider? Woo, I see one and two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight legs on the spider. What about our ladybug? Let's count how many legs there are. One, two, three, four, five, six on our ladybug. What about that worm? I don't see any legs on the worm. What about that crab with their pinch, pinch, pinchers? One, two, three, four, five legs on one side. Let's count the others. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten legs on the crab. There's an ant. How many legs does the ant have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six legs on the ant. And a grasshopper, how many legs? You might think this is a leg, but I think that's just its tail. There's one, two, three, four, five, six legs on a grasshopper. And our bonus question says, what insect is this? Label it, we just learned about that. It's a bee. So let's look back at our first page and see if we can answer our question now. Our question said, what keeps bees so busy? What do you think keeps bees so busy? Remember we talked about it. I know you're thinking they're busy eating and working and they fly back and forth to get food, right? So that's what bees do to stay busy. Thank you boys and girls for joining me for our article today. I hope you enjoyed learning about bees. 
maybe try to go outside and see if you can spy some bees. You have to look outside for some bees. I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you later. Bye friends.